high. It does stay dry throughout the afternoon. A cold front does enter the big country and stall out north of I-20. Areas to the north of that will be a little bit cooler than what we do, than what we do see south of that front. It should be a mostly sunny day, but cloud cover does increase during the late afternoon and early evening. The evening is going to be cloudy, but those clouds do decrease overnight. Cloud cover hangs on a bit longer in the heartland, but by around daybreak tomorrow looks to be all clear. Wednesday afternoon looks to be sunny and dry. Today for those highs, expect uh, temperatures north of I-20, anywhere from the mid to upper 50s. Then we do see a warm-up as we head down to the south. Heartland areas up there in the mid to upper 60s, so quite the wide range of afternoon temperatures. That trend is going down. Will be a bit chilly Wednesday behind a cold front, upper 40s, mid 50s Thursday, return to 60 degree weather by Friday. Today, expect a light and variable wind. Overnight, the winds will be out of the south as they do stay light, but by around tomorrow morning, daybreak, the, the winds make a turn to the west northwest and it will be a little bit breezy as a, as a cold front does move through. Today for Abilene, 62 and mostly sunny. Overnight, it's going to be cold and quiet, 35 degrees with decreasing clouds. Brownwood today, sunny and mild, upper or mid 60s for those highs. Then overnight, partly clear and going to be cold tomorrow morning, down to 35 degrees. So today looks to be real nice. Most areas up there in the low 60s. It will be a pleasant afternoon. And then a cold front overnight will make for a chilly Wednesday, Thursday. Temperatures recover to the mid 50s. Friday back to the 60s. Next chance for rain is Friday night into Saturday morning. But besides that, the forecast looks to be pretty dry and, and uh, mainly mild.